Hey guys, as I always tell you guys, as soon as I find something out um, to prepare you guys and to let you know what's coming, as soon as I find out, I will let you guys know. So I my, have my husband here, which I'll introduce. Say hi. Hey, what's going on, everybody? He's going to um, let you guys know what's going on and the news that we just heard, okay? So uh, actually, there were some sources that just uh, reported, well, I'll read the letter statement says that Putin just made the statement to his military leaders. Friday evening will be beautiful for the whole world. We have started down a road of no return. Those were his quotes. The same day they are cutting their internet connection to the world. When this goes public, many will freak if they are paying attention. All U.S. agencies are guessing a mass hypersonic weapons attack or a massive cyber hit on the U.S. and U.K. at the same time. Be prepared by noon Friday. That will be 8 p.m. Moscow time. I'm giving you the info as it was just sent to me from an agent in Tel Aviv. Take it for what it's worth. So... That was somebody that I follow on Facebook. Who's, that, who's that he's the one that sent it, but let them know as of um, as of t um, what they what was just in the news today. So I think it's also ironic that Washington, um, and the House just passed on um, a one point five trillion omnibus spending bill to keep the federal government open and provide thirteen point six billion in aid for Ukraine. Now, where's all this money coming from? And then before that, there was a $15.6 billion bill that was passed for COVID-19. Um, like, I don't... It's, it's, it's crazy. Where's all this money coming from? So we got to understand that there's too much things, too much is going on at one time. So like I said, just to prepare you guys, just look out, stay, stay in prayer. This is not to scare you, but just something is not right. We got to just really stay prayed up. That dream I had the other day, I feel like God is definitely warning us. We need to just stay alert, stay vigilant, and just know that we are in the last days. Jesus is coming. It's time for us not to play around in sin. Repent and get right with God. Do not play. You are not promised tomorrow. We don't know what is going to happen tomorrow. And they said it's a Friday. We just don't know. This is not to scare you, but just to let you know the hour we are living in. God told us in Matthew 24, these things will come. We need to take heed. It's time for us to repent and get right with God. But Jesus is coming, y'all. Look up. Our, redemp our redemption is drawing nigh.